Okay, so there should be no pressure to get back into any cardio kind of fitness after having your baby. You just start when you feel like you're comfortable. The best place to start is doing a little bit of walking. Yeah. Um, and with walking, it's just important to hold your posture really nice. As you're walking, just think about using your abdominal muscles just a little bit, tucking your bottom under slightly, and think about landing on the heel and pushing off through the toe as you walk, which just makes your legs a little bit more active. Yeah. But a little exercise that you can do while you are in the house, um, if you're not getting out as much as you want to, and it's good to get your heart and lungs going very slightly, just using the sofa here. If we turn around, again, put your hands on your hips. Yeah. It's a good place to be to keep them nice and stable. And then we're just going to be tapping one toe on and come back down. Tap the other toe and come back down. And we can speed it up a little bit. Tap, down, tap, down. And just be really mindful of placing that foot down strongly tightening through the leg a little bit and keeping up tall as you do it good and you should feel your legs working just a little bit there yeah, and it's not too much but not too much yeah. yeah and you use your abdominal muscles your tummy muscles a little bit as you do it so i think that might be around 20. that's a good time to just have a little break give your legs a little shake um, <laughs> And then you could maybe do three sets of those. That doesn't take you too long. It's the sort of thing that maybe you can do just when you've got baby down to bed before you sit down and relax. Yeah. Then you can do a few of those just to get your heart pumping around a little bit.